But the big boost is the return of Fernando Torres after two outs, particularly after the hard time he gave Nemanja Vidic at Old Trafford in March. It's the intercity rivalry that's dominated top division football in this country since the war. Liverpool against Manchester United is next. And real concentration on the face of Fernando Torres. Commentators Andy Gray and Rob Hawthorne. So which of the returning strikers will have his say? Will it be Torres or will it be Wayne Rooney a day after his 24th birthday? Fabio Aurelio with the corner. Torres with the header. Here's Torres. And finds Insua. Right across to Torres. Count in the middle with Aurelio. Torres trying to get his shot away. And Evra. Now Torres. His heels clipped by Evra. Well, I think Torres just goes across him there. Ever makes no attempt to tackle Torres at all. It just Torres gets across the face of him, the legs just tangle. It's one of those accidental challenges. Torres showed plenty of purpose. And this time he is caught. Right. And this time it is going to be a booking. Yeah, it will be a booking. A bit of a lunge in the end from Patrice Evra. Clutched away, counts! And again saved! Count pulls it across this time, Torres! And away by Carrick. And everything they've thrown out in his coat with so far. Well, this is a fantastic save. He has to use his feet initially, and then he knows he has to be at full stretch. To be fair, not just once, but twice. He's got himself up, and he's blocked Count's effort as well. team have started really well. He's into difficulties there against Insua, but Carrick stopped Torres. It's Torres. Good for the return pass from Count. Torres gave Villains by Daniel Agger. Carrick in trying to keep the momentum going for United, ended up giving it away, and Torres earning a free kick out of Vidic. Great play from Torres, just puts his body anyway, you watch him, he knows he's coming, look, he steps across Vidic, and he knows he's getting a free kick, and he's just drawn the referee's attention to the fact he's been thumped by Vidic. Clever play from Torres. Jamie Carragher. They're going to play for the free kick from Torres. Oh, left back had given up on it. Quicker than Valencia. As I say, I think that might have been part of the reason that Aurelio has been picked to play this side. For the referee. Johnson. Better on by Ben Ayun. Now Torres. The drive of Torres has won Liverpool the corner. Late in the first half here, but at half time it's Liverpool nil. But it hasn't really been a major decision for Andre Mariner. There he is finding Fernando Torres. There's Lucas. Torres. Evra is casual, given away to Torres. Mascherano. Vidic against Torres. <laughs> I don't think there's any argument about that, do you? <laughs> Slipped on to Torres, who is onside here. Fernando Torres showing plenty of drive. Plenty of drive, ball. but poor appreciation of what was around them for someone so talented. Certainly looked offside. I know he bends his run here, but they let him go. Mm, I think that's touch and go. Well, he's looking for the far post and Aurelio coming in there, but he's miles away from his target there, and he knows that. There Vidic did, it's Fabio Aurelio, and Torres is offside.
This is a good header from Vidic. As the ball ends a good one and Torres fancies it. And Vidic has to make it has it on their home patch. Run back by Insua. Here's Torres. Away by Vidic. Fed in by Giggs and taken off Berbatov's head by Fernando Torres and the flag was up anyway. Yeah, he just got in a bit early. But nonetheless, Torres wouldn't have known that. Well, he's not offside. Simple fact is he wasn't off. Lucas was a little deeper than everyone else there and was playing him on. Well, defending nonetheless from Torres, who was not to know about the flag. Ma oh, Mascherano and Glenn Johnson just doing enough. Gautier is back up now and getting into position as he needs to be with Torres on the ball. No push by Ebra. Oh, by Carragher. And then Lucas. Torres on to Kaut. Kaut. Through to Torres. And Ferdinand has to stay strong and can't. And Torres scores for Liverpool. He had muscle vintage last year. He's done it to Ferdinand this. A ruthless finish. And from being at such a low ebb, Liverpool now on a high. Well, the main man at last gets a chance. And all along I've said about finding that pass and that Yossi Berayun was probably, of all the players out there in the midfield area, the most likely to do that. It's a glorious through ball. And that's what I mean about Cout earlier on not taking the shot on. This is exactly the same area. See you real and smash the back of the ball. He's had a quietish game, Torres, but he only needs that, a half a chance. And such is his quality of the Spaniard. He can punish any team in the world at any time. His star striker has just come up with the goods. There's Torres, looking to turn provider now. It's a foul by Vidic on Torres. Vidic presumably didn't hear the whistle, but uh, he's got a yellow anyway. Not the best part of an hour since uh, Pepe Reina was asked to make a save. Torres. Run. Here's Fabio Aurelio. Torres didn't work for him, just tried to roll it back into Aurelio. And they're dealing with a threat. So for the uh, second time in a week, Rafa Benitez takes his goal scorer off. But a rather more harmonious reaction this time. <laughs> Different reception, yeah. No, it's just a good goal. That's what it is. It's a top finish from one of the best in the business, if not the best, at what he does. I just hope for Rafa Benitez's side, it's not premature. And every precaution has to be taken with the fitness of Fernando Torres, yep. such a key player for them. Coming back injured from international duties, had time to ready himself for this game, which is always a big one on the Liverpool calendar, even more so this year. And now, without him, they've got... Just under 10 minutes, plus stoppage time to see it through. Liverpool halt the crisis. The run of four defeats ended against their biggest rivals. The star striker, Fernando Torres, getting the first of go Come back. And get all the reaction to what turned out to be, for Liverpool, a very, very good day.